Still there. Winter Wonderland in the Southeast? Yes, please. Beach Mountain is perched high in the Blue Ridge Mountains in northwestern North Carolina, just miles from the Tennessee border. With an elevation of 5,500 feet, it's known as the Mile High City of the East. This town is really special in the winter, and with the right plan, your trip will definitely be one to remember. Mo and I picked January for this adventure because it averages 18 inches of snowfall. February is a close second with 14 inches. Boy, do we luck out. Several inches of fresh snow fall overnight and we're expecting even more. Let the games begin. Yes, hitting the slopes. Florida girl doesn't really know how to walk in snow. Uh oh. Uh oh. Thank goodness Mo knows how to drive in the snow. <laughs> Baby, you got this. You got this. See this hat? Four one two. We use the snow. Okay, Mr. Pittsburgh, just get us to the slopes alive. This is so crazy. Beach Mountain Ski Resort is one of the top ski destinations on the East Coast. Here are two big reasons why. There are 95 acres of skiable terrain and the mountain has 830 feet of vertical drop. That's a setup for one hell of a playground. While Mo prepares to take a few laps in the play yard, I'll tell you about the rest of the mountain. This park has eight lifts, including two carpet conveyors and 17 different trails. That's pretty good for the East Coast. There are four black trails, seven blues, two powder bowls, a terrain park, and three green trails. You'll definitely want to bookmark BeachMountainResort.com. The website stays up to date on which chairlifts and trails are open, as well as which trails have been groomed. Okay, Mo seems to be getting a hang of the whole heel-toe thing on the snowboard. Let's go! Hey, baby. Hey. He seems a bit nervous, though. I got you! We jump on the lift and head to a trail called Freestyle. Oh, while I'm thinking about it, here's a quick pro tip for maximizing your GoPro footage. This is my first time using the GoPro 11 on a snowboard. I attached it to the nose like usual, had it set on the wide angle lens. Well, I'm glad I checked the footage. It turns out wide angle is just not wide enough. No worries. The new GoPro 11s have two additional wide lenses, super view and Hyperview. Jump on the app and put that bad boy on Hyperview. What a difference, right? Don't worry, you're not losing any quality in Hyperview either. It's still shooting in 4K at 60 frames per second. That's right. Okay, okay, back to the mountain. Don't you just love fresh snow? I am geeky. I hate that being a good thing. It's very humbling. 
But it's fun. You get it. The good thing about the way this ski resort is set up is the ability to progress one run at a time. The different lifts give you options so you don't have to start at the very top of the mountain as a newbie. Lifts 3 and 4 take you to the green runs. Lift 1 takes you to the start of the long blue trail. And when you're ready for the steeper blues and the blacks, hop on lift 5 or 6 and head to the top. Believe it or not, the chairlifts at beach can move more than 10,000 skiers every hour. So even if the lines look long, you can navigate around the slopes pretty quickly. That being said, I recommend visiting on a weekday if crowds stress you out. Slope tickets are a bit cheaper than too. $60 versus $90 for 9 a.m. to close. You can also break it down by day part. For instance, a morning ticket, 9 a.m. to 1, is just $38 during the week and $60 on the weekend. It's all right there on the website. What? When your ponytail starts to form icicles, true story, you can catch a reprieve at one of the two taverns on the mountain. Just make sure you keep your wits about you because there is plenty to do at beach when the sun drops to the west. The slopes are well lit and stay open until 9 on Sunday through Thursday and 10 on Fridays and Saturdays. Night session slow tickets during the week can be as cheap as 26 bucks. You can't beat that. Well, except maybe this free adventure. It's beautiful out here day and night. Let's go sledding. That's right. When there's snow on the ground, the sledding hill on Beach Mountain is open. Time to sled. It's free and I promise you don't have to be pint sized to enjoy this one. <laughs> Mo and I buy a cheap plastic sled and go for it. <laughs> These suckers are fast. Right. New world record. <laughs> Bingo. <laughs> Later, dudes. Mo gets the wipeout of the night. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> At the very least, it's good people watching and you'll laugh a lot. I didn't make it. <laughs> Coming in hot. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Uh, well. Pro tip. If you don't have a sled, head to the hill anyway. No sled, no problem. There's a bin at the bottom, and it seems some people just leave their sleds when they're done. I mean, what are they going to do with them in Florida? If the bin is empty, you can still rent a sled for a few bucks an hour. Just get there before five. Oh, and trust me on this one. Wear something warmer than jeans. In fact, make sure you wear layers everywhere you go at beach. Oh, we're doing this. There's one more adventure that needs to be on your to-do list for Beach Mountain. Yeah. You gotta go tubing. He's crazy. The tubing hill sits just below the ski slopes at Beach. Save this adventure for a day with less snow. You can take solo tubes and race. <laughs> Do spins the whole way down. <laughs> or jump on a double and have a blast. Surprise! <laughs> Pro tip, the double tube seems to go way, way faster than the single. Hey. Man, the doubles are fast. Special machines blow snow on the tube runs even when the temperatures don't drop below 32 degrees. It's a very popular activity. So I highly recommend buying your tickets for tubing well in advance. They sell out all the time. Tubing season is open from late November to mid-March. Right now, weekday tickets are $32 for two hours and $38 on the weekend. Hey. 
<laughs> That's so fun. <laughs> What'd you think? Yeah, that was like being a kid again. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, fast. what's that like? I don't know. It was fast. It was so fast. The double is where it's at. Yeah, double. The double. Yeah, Go for it. Better together. It's, it's accurate in this case. It's always better together, baby. Always better together, baby. Ew. Look at baby. Hey. Look at this place. Beach Mountain is a true winter wonderland. Holy, holy. Full of adventure, Woo. just tucked away in the southeast, waiting for you to get out and explore. Even if you're just a girl from the beach. Hey, what are you doing? I don't know what I'm doing. I have no idea. I don't know what I'm doing in the snow. Fun though. That's all right. Hey, did you catch any of our new merch in that episode? What? Yeah. We have links to our new merchandise right here on YouTube. So go over and check it out. It yeah. really helps us out. Some slick stuff on there. It's cool. And a special thanks to Uncle Eve and Aunt Lisa. Once again, they let us stay at their crib. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's super cool. It's right, it's an Airbnb. It's right across from the slopes. It's super cute. Yeah. There's a game room in the complex, a pool, a hot tub. Pinnacle. It's awesome. We're gonna put a link to their Airbnb right in the description below. Yeah. Go check it out. Pretty slick. Guys, beach is also really great in the summer. Oh yeah. The high temperature is at 72 degrees. We were there in July. It was amazing. Didn't even need air conditioning. They turned the slopes into a downhill mountain biking park. Amazing. You can check out the waterfalls, even walk a mile high swinging bridge. Oh my. It's a little freaky, but it's super cool. Dude, he said bridge was something else, man. We'll put a link to our summer video right here. If you found this video helpful, hit that like button. Come on now. Go ahead and subscribe. You're already there. What are we doing? We want our experiences to help make your next adventure epic. That's why we go all these places and do it. Well, that because it's fun. It's what Art of Adventure is all about. Facts. All that's left for you to do. Come on. Now. Tell them, babe. Just go get it. We'll see you out there. Yeah, man.